we will do visual inspection first we will check all the pins for any kind of damage cracks loose band discoloration corrosion or pitted pins the discoloration of pin is due to excessive heat which is caused by excessive corrosion and poor contact between pin and sockets everything seems to be okay we will spray little contact cleaner and then we will clean each pin with lint free cloth Now we will do go no go test. This is our no go gauge. One side is for smaller pin and other side is for bigger pin. First we will check each pin for any kind of play or looseness. Now we will take no go gauge and start with the bigger pin. We will just keep our gauge on the tip of the pin and give a slight push. If the gauge is going inside that means the pin is damaged and has become thinner. If the gauge is not going that means our pin is fine that is why it is known as no go gauge there is a caution as per amm do not use too much force when you push the wear gauge onto the pins the wear gauge is a no go tool that will not engage on the pin if they are in correct condition if you push the wear gauge with force onto the pin you can cause damage to them with other side of the gauge we will do same step with the smaller pin if we find any kind of damage or no go test is failing then we will have to replace the whole receptacle in our case everything seems to be fine so now we will be retalking the connections 